Welcome back to Fox Recaps. Today I'm going to explain the movie Palma, released in the year 2021. The movie begins in 1977 with the scene of a middle-aged man, Igor Polskiv, carrying his dog Palma in a basket into the airport. Palma is a female dog who is about to fly with her master. She carefully listens to every bit of noise around her and smells everything she comes across. After getting his passport checked, Igor proceeds to board the flight along with Palma. As he is about to get on the flight, the air hostess asks him about the dog's health documents. Igor tries to retrieve it, searching around his pockets, but fails to find it. He pleads with the air hostess to let him get into the flight as it is urgent. He has to report to his dream job the next day. Listening to his story, the air hostess asks him to visit the doctor in the airport and get the documents approved as soon as possible. After that, Igor heads to meet the doctor and gets Palma checked for any infections. The doctor examines her carefully and refuses to provide him with the approval certificate as Palma has an infection inside her ears. Igor even tries to bribe the doctor, but the man stays firm in his decision. Sweating and confused, Igor returns to the airport terminal. He meets with the air hostess Nina and tells her everything. He mentions that Palma has no one to look after her and he is the only one taking care of her. Seeing Igor's eyes full of tears, Nina agrees to let Palma inside. But in the meantime, the airport's manager arrives there and refuses to let the dog inside without the documents. Igor is heartbroken and is compelled to leave his beloved friend behind. He pushes Palma's cart away from the runway and lets her out. He then hugs her for the last time and apologizes for what he is about to do. Palma also looks back at her master in a loving way. After some time, he throws away her favorite ball and Palma rushes behind it. While she is busy, Igor hurriedly boards the plane. Palma returns and notices Igor getting inside the plane. She drops the ball to the ground and starts running towards him. Everybody inside the airplane notices her chasing them, but Igor reluctantly ignores her. Palma blocks the plane on the runway, which makes the pilots stop the engine for some seconds. When she moves aside, they restart it and take off. Palma chases it and watches it fly away until it vanishes into the clouds. Later, the airport guards get the complaint about the dog and set off to catch her. Palma runs away from them and comes across Tikhanov, a caretaker at the hangar. She then hides under a plane. The guards approach Tikhanov and inquire about the dog, but he lies to save her. The scene then shifts to a little boy named Kolya, who is looking through a flying plane window. One of the passengers is a high-ranked minister named Ivan Lisko, who is afraid of takeoffs and landings. Kolya's father, Vyacheslav Lazarev, is flying the plane and is worried about his son. He asks an air hostess if Kolya has fallen asleep. On the other hand, Tikhanov grows fond of Palma and offers her some food. As she is about to eat it, she hears the noise of a plane and starts running towards the runway. The pilots are ready to land the plane, but stop when they notice a dog on the runway. Lisko, inside the airplane, is stumped during overshoot and feels humiliated in front of the foreign delegates on board. The plane manages to land and Lisko immediately scolds the airport manager for the act. Palma scans through each passenger getting out of the plane in search of her master Igor. The airport manager, on the other hand, gets angry at the dog and orders to kick her out of the airport as soon as possible. The security group finally manages to capture Palma and lock her inside the bus. Kolya steps down from the plane and overhears the officers planning to kill the dog. He feels bad for the innocent dog and decides to save it. Following that, he enters the bus and lets Palma free. The agitated security is about to hit the little guy just before Lazarev arrives and tells them that he is his son. Later, the airport manager starts scolding pilot Lazarev for his inability to land properly and also for his son letting the dog free. The pilot explains to her that his wife had died recently and he is in a bad mental condition. He further adds that he is worried about his son all the time, which might have hampered his ability to make decisions. After listening to Lazarev, the manager tries to console him, telling him that he is about to get his international license in a month. Lazarev seems happy after getting the news. Elsewhere, Palma with the red ball in her mouth returns to Tikhanov. 
he places a mat under the shade to let her rest. After that, we see Kolya reaching a hotel with his father, Lazarev. He seems unhappy with his father, so decides to run away at night. He reaches the airport and attempts to get a ticket back to his hometown. The staff refuses to give him a ticket and informs a security officer to inquire about the kid's parents. Kolya sees a family and pretends to be with them to get into the airplane. The air hostess finds out about his act and informs the security officer. But Kolya runs away before he can be found. He is seen hiding inside the small cabin outside the plane. Palma notices him and starts to bark at him. Before the security guard can spot them, Kolya gets out of the cabin and runs along with Palma. She guides him to her hiding spot and the two spend their night there. The next morning, Lazarev finds his son missing and gets worried. As he is about to file a police complaint, he receives a call from Tikhanov, who informs him that his son is safe. Lazarev immediately rushes to the airport and finds his son sleeping with Palma. He forcefully tries to take his son back home, but Palma intervenes and separates them. She barks at Lazarev and after which Tikhanov tells him to go for his flight and assures him that he will take care of his son. After Lazarev departs, Tikhanov prepares some food for Kolya and offers him some. He also tells him that getting into the plane's cabin is dangerous. The air hostess Nina arrives there and scolds Tikhanov for drinking coffee, which is bad for his health. She turns out to be Tikhanov's daughter. During their talk, Palma runs towards the runway as a plane has landed there. Kolya reaches Palma, who is looking at the passengers exiting the plane, searching for her master. He stands beside her and tells her that he is also alone like her as his mother has left him forever. The next day, looking at the pitiful condition of Palma, Kolya tries to get Igor's address from the ticket counter in the airport. But the woman at the counter refuses to give him the details because it is confidential. Meanwhile, Palma approaches a landing airplane again and this time she sees a man who looks like Igor. She follows him to the terminal but gets spotted by the security guards on the way. Palma, however, manages to enter the terminal and finds out that the guy is not Igor. The security guards chase her and are ready to catch her with a net. Kolya distracts the guards at the right time, helping Palma escape. Because of Palma's run, the terminal faces a lot of destruction of property. Kolya and Palma manage to get away from the security and hide in a safe place. The lady from the ticket counter approaches them and gives them Igor's address. She also shows them the route to get away from the terminal. In the next scene, we see the airport manager getting angry at Lazarev because of the destruction done by Palma and his son at the terminal. She bribes Lazarev telling him that if he helps Palma get captured, he will get his international flying license approved. Lazarev accepts the proposal and approaches the place where both Palma and Kolya, along with the dog catchers, are. Nina and Tikhanov are also present there and they try to stop the dog catchers. However, they fail to stop them and Palma gets captured inside a van. Kolya gets very sad seeing Palma being taken away from him. At last, Nina hands Lazarev the letter Kolya had written for Igor. At night, Lazarev takes out the letter and starts reading it. In the letter, he finds Kolya appealing to Igor to take back his loyal companion, Palma. He also mentions that the most painful time in anyone's life is when they are left by their loved ones. Lazarev gets emotional after reading the letter. Meanwhile, he also notices Kolya getting out of his room at night. Lazarev realizes that he is going to rescue Palma out of custody and decides to help his son. Both of them reach the dog shelter and surprisingly find Nina already present there. They get to know that Palma has run away from custody. Kolya tells them that he knows where they can find Palma. Afterwards, they reach the airport and Kolya stands beside the recently arrived airplane to search for Palma. To his distress, he does not find her there. Later, he notices her hurrying towards the airplane to take a look at the passengers exiting the plane. Lazarev realizes that he must do something to help the poor dog. The next day, Lazarev calls a news reporter who takes a photo of Palma and writes her story on the front page of the newspaper. The airport manager gets very angry with Lazarev because of his act. She also tells him that now he will never get an international license. Right at that moment, the manager receives a call from the minister, 
Who wants to use Palma's story for his opportunity to get in the eye of the people? He praises Lazarev for his works and also approves his international license. After the news, Palma becomes an attraction for the people arriving at the airport. As time passes, Palma continues looking for her master at the airport. Eventually, a year passes, but she still hasn't found Igor. Lazarev and Kolya are also seen getting along. The minister orders the airport staff to make a closure for Palma just beside the runway. Kolya feels bad for the dog because the minister is taking advantage of her situation. Palma stops eating any kind of food, and after examining her, the doctor explains that she has gone through depression and will only get over it if she meets Igor. One night, it is raining heavily and Kolya notices Palma out in the rain with her sad face. He steps out and tries to take Palma along with him, but she does not obey him. An angered and hurt Kolya tells her that everyone he loves always leaves him alone, first his mother and now Palma. He then takes his jacket off and puts it over her to keep her warm. Both of them spend their night in the rain together. The next morning, Palma is active and happy, unlike how she was the night before. Kolya is very happy to see her playing and takes her to his home. At home, Lazarev gets a call from the department telling him that Igor has arrived to take Palma back with him. He takes Kolya and Palma with him to the airport. Kolya refuses to send Palma with Igor because he has grown attached to the dog. But Lazarev makes him understand that she is someone else's property, and if he really loves her, he should be able to let her go. Kolya agrees, and after they get out of the car, they notice that the minister has called various press teams for live coverage of Igor's return to get sympathy for himself. Later, Igor sees Palma and moves towards her, finally reuniting with the dog. Palma approaches him, but she doesn't seem to be much excited to meet him. Kolya hands the collar belt of Palma to Igor and returns with a sad face and a heavy heart. Seeing his son in this condition, Lazarev tries to talk with Igor and requests him to leave Palma, offering him a decent amount of money. Here, Igor reveals that he also does not want to take Palma back and is compelled to do so because of the minister. The minister has warned him that if he doesn't take Palma back, he will fire him. In the next scene, we see Igor taking Palma away. Palma resists and tries to run away but gets caught by the security guards. They forcefully make her board the plane. Meanwhile, Lazarev, who is the pilot of the same plane, refuses to fly the plane at the last moment. The airport manager threatens Lazarev, telling him that he might even lose his pilot license because of his act. Lazarev does not listen to her and decides to opt out of the plane. The manager is compelled to call another pilot to fly the plane. Meanwhile, one of the air hostesses approaches Igor and asks for Palma's medical report to let her fly in the plane. Igor doesn't seem to have any medical reports. The minister gets angry at the manager and asks her to let the flight take off as soon as possible. The manager replies that the rules are bound to be followed. She also mentions that without the medical report, she cannot allow Palma to fly in the airplane. Igor understands everything and releases Palma. He tells the minister that he might have made some mistake to recognize the dog. In the last scene, we see Palma running out from the plane towards Kolya, who is waiting for her outside. They hug each other and look very happy to reunite. That was all from the video. I hope you liked it. Subscribe for more content like this and hit the like button to help us out. Also, leave a comment if you want us to recap your favorite movie. Until next time, take care.